Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Introducts My name is Zahir Wahyuda Arianto My student ID number A310201053 From the Indonesian Language and Literature Education Study Program Muhammadiyah University of Surakarta I am here to give my opinion about e-learning to fulfill the text of the standardized test preparation course which is taught by Mr. Zainal Arifin E-learning is a teaching and learning concept that allows the delivery of teaching materials to students using the internet Intranet or other computer network media and other electronic equipment that can support the learning process However, from most opinions, a uh, learning is always identified with the use of the internet so that it allows distance learning to occur and is not limited by place and time. And in relation to this, it can be interpreted that e-learning is a new strategy in learning that is adapted to the development of the digital information era. My opinion about e-learning, e-learning has many positive impact in my opinion, including 1. Easily accessible, simply using a smartphone or other technological device such as a laptop connect to the internet you can access the material you want to learn by implementing e-learning you can carry out learning activities anywhere anytime to more affordable cost of course we all want to increase knowledge without financial constraints with a uh, internet data packet, you can access a variety of learning materials without worrying about missing a lesson if you don't attend. It is recommended that you register as a member in e-learning because member fees are cheaper than taking lesson or course at learning institution. Three flexible study time usually most people will want to learn more do not have no time one of the reasons might be because your time is already used for work digital based learning or e-learning is the solution time to study can be done at any time without being tied to study horse for weight insight by implementing e-learning of course you will find many things that you didn't know before this is because some of the subject matter available in e-learning is not yet available in print media such as books that are often used in conventional teaching and learning methods. This is different from face-to-face -face learning which is done by reading books. However, e-learning also has disadvantages, namely understanding of the material presence is not comprehensive because the teacher does not face to face with student in my opinion whatever the learning methods we shall try our best to study thanks wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh